the drills that I'm going to show you in this video will take your jump rope moves to the next level and allow you to be able to learn how to do the basic jump rope moves so you can go and do fancy tricks and get in great shape later on. Now you're not going to need a jump rope while doing these drills, at least not for the beginning portion. You can get the cordless jump rope, that might help you get the feel in your hands. But for now, we're going to have nothing in our hands and we're going to just jump off the ground. The first way to practice jumping rope is putting the rope down and literally pretending like you jump rope. I want you to do the exact proper form that you would do if you were jumping rope. Make sure to keep your feet together when you're practicing, even without the rope. Make sure to slightly bend your knees. Do make sure that you actually just turn in your wrist the same way you would if you were using a jump rope. This is the proper jump rope form. This will help you get the rhythm and timing down. And it's still a great workout. The next thing you wanna do is tap your side. You wanna jump up, tap, then land. You are mimicking the timing that it takes to jump rope. This will help you get your rhythm and hearing that sound kind of mimics the same sound that you'll get, especially if you're using something like a beaded jump rope, but pretty much any jump rope, you hit it. Sound, and that is reminiscent of the jump rope. I actually do this sometimes if I don't have a jump rope and just want to get a workout in, or if I'm just trying to get better and keep my skills up. So you see, this isn't just for beginners, this is for anybody at any level. If you're trying to learn a new move, this will help you with some of the moves. You see me doing high knees with nothing but my hands right here? Now I'm gonna show you me doing high knees with the jump rope. And they look almost identical. I'll put them side by side. You see me right here practicing the full twist? Now you see me with the jump rope with the full twist. Now you'll see them side by side. This telepractice can help you with almost every type of footwork jump rope move there is. Here's the entire routine that I normally do. One minute of mimicking jump rope. Now you wanna keep doing it over and over again. It gets the rhythm and timing correct. If I'm trying to do a special move, I just do that. And then I follow that up with one minute of doing taps. And I basically do that back and forth until I reach about 10 minutes. It gets me a good workout in and helps me to practice. It's a way to jump rope without actually jumping rope. Try these moves out and comment down below if they help you with your jump rope skills. After you get these drills down, if you wanna learn some jump rope tricks that are easy that anybody can do, check the video out I have below. I'm sure to help you. Jumping rope is all about rhythm and that is what these drills help with. Now that you got the basics and you know how to jump rope, let's get you the proper jump rope. Check this video out right here. It'll tell you exactly what jump rope you should choose and when you should choose it. And as always, just start. We're about being perfect later. Peace.